Hey everybody, Heidi here, Paradise Center for the Arts Executive Director, and I am excited to tell you all about the brand new season guide that is out. So we just had them delivered yesterday. We're really excited. We're getting ready to put together that mailer that we do um, every year when these come out. It'll have a little letter inside of it talking a little bit about the season. But I wanted to share with all of you because I know that there's a bunch of you that are not members and a bunch of you that are not um, on our physical address mailing list, but do we do have your email addresses. So I just want to tell you a little bit about what this season guide um, is all about. It says 2022-2023 because our season runs from July 1 until June 30th. So we're just about done with the 21-22 season, getting ready to start that uh, new season 2022-2023. Um, of course, you all know that we book not only the shows, but all of our galleries well in advance, up to about a year, year and a half in advance, because we have to do that. So we have scheduling as far as um, performers go and artists. So we just want to let you know that when you open up your season guide, when you get it, we are grateful to the Faribault Daily News. They're the organization that puts this together for us. It looks very similar to the one that we had last year. As a matter of fact, I have one right here. So you can see that they're similar, but you should be able to tell a little bit of a difference. This one's a little bit darker. On the inside, there's going to be this letter from me. That's the director's notes. And then we've kind of set it up like a playbill. So we've listed the cast like we did last year. That is um, four of us that we had headshots of. And then we also have listed Rhonda Norgard, uh, Char Johnson, and Vicki Peterson. Rhonda works for us as an administrative assistant, does a lot of our HR things, um, a little bit of our uh, banking, all kinds of things. Um, and then Vicki and Char work the box office. And then we've got Linda Willie is actually um, our custodian. She comes in and cleans for us every week. And we are incredibly grateful for that opportunity. And then, of course, we've listed at the bottom our supporting cast. And those are the people that are on our board of directors. If you're interested in becoming a board member, please give us a shout out. Um, I am always thinking of people and trying to make a little list. So if I call you, don't be surprised. Your name's been on my mind for a while. But if you're someone out there and you're interested in being a part of the Paradise Center for the Arts and you'd like to be on our board of directors, we meet the second Monday of every month on uh, the 5.30 to 7 o'clock. Typically, they don't go quite that long, but we meet either here at the Paradise or via Zoom, so that's another option for you. Next, you're going to find the season at a glance. So what we've got is we've got the rest of 2022 on this side and then 2023 over here, so starting out in January. And that'll give you a list of the performances that are going to be happening inside the auditorium. We've got a little page that talks about membership benefits, which is great. And then one of my very favorite pages, the list of the 100 club members. I want to let you know that if you go ahead and count these, there's going to be a couple of them that you're not going to see. You're not going to get to 100. You're going to get to 98. Because there were a couple of people that donated that didn't want to be listed um, in the publication, but do want to be listed on our sculpture, which is finished. We're really excited that hopefully we'll get all of our little name tiles will be engraved and we'll get that all put together. And within the next month or so, that should be all set up in our lobby. Then we've got a couple of pages of advertising. We're super excited about everyone who advertised. And then it starts right in with Shrek Jr. That's going to be the very first thing that happens in July. Um, again, that starts off at July 15th. It goes through by page all of the different performances that are happening. You're going to see not only a little description of what it is, you'll see a photograph, and then you'll see the really important information, which is the time. Um, I'm sorry, it's right up here. This, this is the name. Easy for me, right? The time and the, the cost of um, each one of the ticket prices. We list the member prices, the non-member prices, and the student prices for each one of those shows. Typically, and we have tried to keep this consistent, a member ticket is $20, a non-member ticket is $25, and a student is $15. We have a couple of shows that are a little bit less expensive and a couple of shows that are a little bit more expensive. You'll notice that the big woo is coming. A member price ticket is $25, and a non-member is $30, and a student is $20. If you see that and the ticket prices are a little bit higher, that's because these guys are more expensive. So we want to make sure that we are being fair to everyone, but actually that we're not losing any money on any of the shows that we have. So we're going to go through all of the rest of that whole season. We've got lots of fun show people that are coming. Uh, some new things, obviously some things that we've had before. We are going to have um, Mick Sterling. Mick Sterling presents. 
They're doing a show called Memphis in the Meantimes. Then again, in September, the, he's coming back to do Elvis, or I'm sorry, Elton John with Strings. We've got a couple of other things that maybe haven't heard before. Galactic Cowboy Orchestra. If you notice, John and Lisey Wright um, and Steve Lato are actually a part of Mick Sterling Presents, that band. And so they're coming back um, and they're going to be putting together this uh, other show for us, which is really exciting. Chad Johnson and the and the, the Minties, they call themselves, the Minnesota Transplants. Of course, we've got the Big Woo. We've got Motivational Speaker on September 1. Or I'm sorry, October 1. Transit Authority, Street Talk is coming back. We're doing a fundraiser for the fire department this year. We've got a theater production that the PCT is doing called The Humans. Joseph Hall is coming back. He's doing his Elvis for us. And what we're going to do this year, ladies, is that's the opening um, hunting weekend. So putting together something fun for the ladies. Trevor McSpadden and Mary uh, Cucciofello are coming. They are um, country singers, really wonderful I think that if you love, um, oh, like locally, like the old country boys, something like that, you're going to love these guys. We've got our friend C. Willie Miles is coming back. We love him. Berlin Players is doing a Christmas carol. Um, so we're really looking forward to that for this Christmas season. And then Mick Sterling Presents is coming back with the Grand Old Opry Christmas. They've done that here before, and it's really well loved. So we know that you'll enjoy having your family around it for the holidays. We have um, a, a video production that's going to be put on that's actually part of um, a gallery exhibit. So this is something that Julie worked on. It's called Wild Lands, Wild Horses. Those tickets just across the board are only $10. So we look forward to having that as a part of that gallery opening. Then in January, From the King for the King, Mick Sterling Presents is coming back to do that one. We're really looking forward to this one. I've actually seen this production at the Zephyr in Stillwater. And it's a fabulous show. If you love um, the gospel music that Elvis sang, you're going to love this show. Andrew Salgado, someone new, also country music based, that is coming to the Paradise Center for the Arts for the very first time. I think you're going to love him. We're bringing back that dance party reunion. That's always exciting. Great sellout show. Might be wanting, as soon as those go on, on our website, you're going to want to get your tickets for that because that one does sell out. Then we've got another PCT production called Wrong Window. The comedian Tommy Ryman is coming back. I haven't seen him here at the Paradise, but he was here before I became the executive director. So we're excited for that one. Super Duos coming back. They're gonna do the music of Simon and Garfunkel again. We did that one this last year and that was so well received that we're bringing them back. Harmonious Whale. Now, some of you have seen Harmonious Whale. If you are a 100 Club member, you had an opportunity to see them um, we had a little event where we invited our, our 100 Club members that we had at the time and then invited them to come and listen to that private concert. So for those of you who haven't seen Harmonious Whale, I think you're going to love them. We've got St. Patrick's Day Celebration with Lato Wright and the Northerly Gales. Again, we're pulling together a couple more of those people who are in that Mick Sterling Presents band and then the Northerly Gales. They have been here. They were actually the last show that we had before the pandemic. So we're excited to have them back. Another play from Merlin Players, The Carpenters, Close to You. If you love Karen Carpenter the way I do, you're going to love that show. Um, and I'll be the one who's like singing in the background, which is not what you're supposed to do at a concert. But I love Karen Carpenter. Then we have the New Folk Booking and Mick Sterling Presents is bringing us Let's Stay Together, a celebration of American soul music. This, These people are backup singers for Mick Sterling's, um, some of his shows. And I've seen them perform before. Incredibly talented. You're going to absolutely love that sound of American soul music. Bringing back our summer comedy with Nathan Smezrud. Now, for those of you that know, in the past, Nathan's shows have been rated R. And we had gotten some complaints that they were a little too rated R. So we're going to tame it down this year. I've asked Nathan to bring me some PG-13 kind of comedy, which he promises me that he's going to do. So we hope that you give um, that show a chance in the summertime. And then your another PCT production, You're a Good Man, Charlie Brown. Mick Sterling Presents, bringing back, um, and he's going to be doing the Bee Gees tribute for that. The music of Patsy Cline with Joy Ann Parker. We just had her here um, not very long ago, but she's coming back next summer, next end of um, June, June 24th. And so she'll be the show that actually ends our season. And then we'll go into July. But then you go a little bit further into this book, turn a couple more pages, 
and you're going to see the 2022-2023 gallery exhibit. This is listing for you all of the gallery openings that we're going to be having and then little examples of the artwork from those artists. Now what I want you to remember is when we have gallery openings, everyone is invited. It's an opportunity for you to come and we'll have our concessions open. You have a glass of wine or beer or a bottle of water and walk around, meet the artist, talk to the artist and get a chance to hear a little bit about how they create their artwork, what their inspiration is, what medium do they use. It's a really fun way to be able to feel up close and personal with the way that someone has created art. We have just one page that talks about our classes and it just says be creative, take a class and it gives you a little bit of information about what's required when you take classes here and then how you can register. You register online now. We didn't used to be able to do that with our ticketing system, but now we have a brand new website. Again, same thing, paradisecenterforthearts.org, but we have a new layout. And so you can actually, from the comfort of your own home, sign up for those classes. Again, a little bit more advertising. Thank you to all of those local businesses that advertise in this publication so that they make it happen. Giving a little map at the very back, and then letting you know that the 23-24 season guide will be coming out a year from now. So again, so excited. Paradise Center for the Arts 2022-2023 season guide. We hope that you enjoy it and we hope that you enjoy the shows. We look forward to seeing you here at the Paradise Center for the Arts. You'll enjoy the new acoustic panels that we have in our auditorium. And hopefully that helps with not only the theater productions, the sound that we have when we have live music performances, but also makes it a little more comfortable for those of us who are a little hard of hearing. Have a wonderful day, everyone, and we look forward to seeing you at the show. Bye.